It's your boy, the wizard here, about to show you the teapot hook. So I have one butterfly hook in, and the other arm is, or leg is this way, right? So I like attacking this wrist and playing, threatening the wrist a bit, kind of baiting them to pull it back, where I grab this here. I'm gonna pull it back and throw the hook in, and then I grab their wrist again just to secure it. And this is the teapot hook. So, you can sweep from here, right? We can go over top into an arm break. Right? And my favorite is you can just let go of the hook and go into a triangle, right? There's so many things to do from this position. So again, so we're here, I'm fighting the wrist, I'm fighting the wrist, he goes to pull back and I grab. I can use this hand to kind of help me stabilize a bit. I pull, hook, grab, and it's secure. And again, sweep. You can come up. Right. The teapot. This is the uh, the spout. Break the spout. You got your foot through the handle, right? And yeah, been having a lot of fun with this one. It's been a good one. So yeah. obviously a very good attack for when somebody is trying to pass your half guard. Yes. A lot of times guys are leaving the chicken wing open, so that's another good point when you're passing half guard is to keep your elbow tucked. Yes. Otherwise you're gonna get motherfucking. Teapotted. Absolutely. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's the teapot by uh, Jordan West. Thank you.